Welcome back to my channel or if you're new here then hi, hello, welcome. So in today's video I decided to go waste free for 24 hours, my eyes are watering. I went and did a little shop at Sainsbury's and it was really, really, really hard. Obviously you will see in the video how it went for me and this is obviously quite different from my channel because I'm normally doing like beauty or fashion and vlogs and stuff like that but I've been wanting to do it for a while so plastic cutting down on red meat stuff like that has been such a big topic at the moment. I thought it'd be perfect to do this video to show you how hard it actually is to go like a hundred percent like waste free and yeah i just really wanted to film this video i've like i said i've been thinking about doing it for a while so i'm gonna stop going on now and i'm just gonna let you watch the video so enjoy <music> so excuse the way I look I've had a shower like I went to the gym this morning about 7 a.m and I'm just letting my hair dry naturally it's actually a lot later now so it's actually 10 past 12 and I went to the gym yeah about seven this morning got back about half eight and I haven't eaten yet I'm absolutely starving when I get back from the gym normally I'll probably have like some oats that I have porridge with some protein powder in but obviously I can't have that today okay so for my breakfast I'm going to be having a banana and peanut butter smoothie but I can't add milk to it. I'm using this banana because I accidentally opened it the other day. And then the peanut butter I'm using is Whole Earth Smooth Peanut Butter. This is in glass, so it's okay to use. So I added the tiniest drop of water into this and it has literally made nothing. Okay, so I'm a bit confused. I've made my peanut butter and banana smoothie, but there's nothing in here. I've got a metal straw, of course, because we don't use plastic straws. We're saving the turtles. But there's like nothing in here, like I use one banana, I don't really want to use anything more than one banana. I put like a whole spoon of um, peanut butter in here and like a tiny drop of water, just so it wasn't like so thick and it's really watery. There's nothing in here. I'm definitely going to have to go make something else because this isn't going to do anything for me. Like how is that a whole banana? I'm going to enjoy my three sips of this. This is really nice. I really wish it was morning. I've literally nearly finished it. I want more. Okay, so it's a bit later now. I've just been sat doing some bits on my laptop. The time... Oh my god. The time actually is 22 past 2 and I am absolutely starving. Also, guys, I need to point out I'm not wearing any makeup because makeup comes in plastic. Apart from my Estee Lauder foundation, but... I'm not just going to wear foundation by itself because that looks a little bit weird. So it's been about two hours since I last ate. My God, that time went really quick. I need to go make myself some food, some lunch because I haven't eaten really and I'm absolutely starving. So that is what we're going to do. So for my dinner today, I'm going to be using a courgette to make some courgette. And then from the Body Coach's book, he has this like gnocchi with midget trees and Romanesco sauce. Obviously I'm not doing gnocchi or anything, as I just said I'm making courgette, but I'm going to be copying the sauce well as best I can because I can't use cashews because obviously they come a thing. So I've got peppers for them, I'm not sure how many I'm going to use yet, I'll probably just end up using that red one. Garlic, some paprika which is in glass. Oh, midget trees are roasting, oh he wants me to roast them. I can't use olive oil though because it's in plastic. Or is it? I'm looking in here but... The only thing there is, is olive oil flavoured with white truffle. Fuck it, I'm going to use it. Let's go for it. I don't know if I'm being stupid, but I literally cannot figure out how to use this spiralizer. Like, I've turned it on, but I just don't know how to use it. <laughs> so I'm going to have to put the warm to get home. And I'm starving! Okay, so this is the dinner I've made. It isn't obviously the most presentable. I don't really know how it's going to taste. Holy said it uh, smells quite garlicky, but I did put a whole clove of garlic in. It's nice, but it's not as nice as with gnocchi. As you've seen when I was at Sainsbury's, I bought a samosa and put it in Tupperware. So I'm going to eat this now because I'm still hungry from that dinner and I had no carbs of it. It's looking a bit worse for wear though. I don't know what's happened there. One thing I would just like to say about the samosa. So obviously I took my own Tupperware and I went over to a lady and asked for a vegetable samosa. 
and she asked one of her colleagues and was like, oh, what do I do with the sticker? So the bags that they put, like the samosa and stuff in, she went to stick the sticker on that and I was like, oh, like the whole point is that I don't actually want the bag. Like I just, so yeah, she like just basically printed it and stuck it off on a tiny little piece of paper. But yeah, having a sticker on a paper bag would just defeat the object of bringing Tupperware all together. To make an A4 sheet of paper uses up 10 litres of water. It is so, so hard trying to buy stuff that's like waste free because everything, everything, even when I take my own Tupperware, has to come with something. Obviously I know they need to put the price on it and yeah, and like what's in it, but to then try and stick it on a plastic bag, paper bag, just defeats the whole object of it. I haven't really eaten a lot today at all, like I normally eat about 1,500 calories, but today I've probably had about, well, God knows. But I've got like some fruit and stuff downstairs, which I know isn't a lot, but it doesn't come with waste and I just am tired. I can't really be bothered to go and cook something, so... Also, it's actually that time of the month for me right now, and I haven't used tampons, pads. I actually had to borrow a pad off my friend the other day, but that's because I came on without when I was out and I didn't have anything on me. Um, but I have not used tampons or like bought tampons or anything in the longest time because I actually have a period cut. So this one is from the brand Maluna and it's spelled like that. But I actually got this off of Amazon. This is not an ad or anything like that. I bought this with my own money. It cost me about 11 pounds, I think. But I never have to buy tampons or anything again. Like you can sleep in it. It's so comfortable. I don't even like feel it up there, TMI, but I don't. Cause I know that can be like the problem with tampons with some people. Like, there's so many different brands that sell these. Obviously, I, like I said, I got mine on Amazon. But honestly, just type in like menstrual cup, period cup, whatever you want to call it. So you can get loads of different ones and they vary depending on like age, whether you've had kids or not, like your activity, if you do sports, just stuff like that. Because obviously it depends on like the thickness and stuff. And they also have, I'm going to show you quickly what I'm talking about. I'll insert a picture now of a menstrual cup in case no one knows, but most people probably do. But the bit that you pull it out with, they also have like loads of different like ones that I've got like one with like a little ring or you can get ones that have like a little pokey bit on the end, a ball and you can get them so many different colours as well they do like glittery ones which is what I have because I'm extra even though no one is ever going to see it I'm only going to see it I've got a glittery one anyway another thing I have is I have one of the little cloths to like take your makeup off now I'm going to be honest with you guys I don't use this all the time I do have makeup pads that, um, like the cotton ones from Primark that you've probably seen in my hauls and stuff because this is from Primark but I only have one one of my sister's friends has three of them and she just alternates between them because obviously I can't wash this every day like when I wear makeup because it just won't be sustainable like I don't wash my clothes every day that is a lot of water I do really want to get the bamboo makeup pads but I want the black ones for eye makeup and they're 17 pounds and obviously I'm unemployed at the moment searching for jobs so I'm waiting until I get a job to invest in those but I do really want them and then I never have to buy makeup pads again. So I couldn't be asked to make any dinner so I'm just going to have an apple but I'm not that hungry anyway because I didn't eat that long ago. Good morning everybody so it's now 10.26 the next day so I woke up a bit later today unintentionally I actually wanted to get to the gym earlier. I got back from the gym I had a shower and all of that stuff and now it's time to go and make breakfast and I'm really upset again because can't have my oats. <laughs> oh, I should have done dinner to get off. I was actually gonna say I think the 24 hours has finished, but it hasn't because I didn't eat or eat until 12 yesterday. So yeah, I'm a bit upset, but we're gonna go downstairs and we're gonna see what there is for me to have for breakfast. At. Something obviously bigger than yesterday because that was oh, we're not doing that again. Okay, so for today's breakfast, I've got some potatoes with mushrooms and then on top I put some paprika, mixed herbs and basil, so I just basically made it up. So, we're going to see what this tastes like. So this breakfast has actually got nicer as I've been eating it, but I'm nearly finished now and the time is 11.14 and I'm not going to eat anything else until like 24 hours over. So I'm going to wrap this video up here because... I'm done eating, well not this but I will be done when I've finished this. I really hope you enjoyed this video, if you did make sure to like and subscribe to my channel. Just done there, thank you so much for watching and I will see you in my next video, bye!